Hey YouTube, what's up? It's James here. Today I'm going to unbox a Wi-Fi repeater. I ordered this Wi-Fi repeater online from a Chinese company called AliExpress. Um, that company has been very good. Uh, I've been getting things from AliExpress on time and intact. So um, check it out. Uh, let's unbox it. I'll explain what a Wi-Fi repeater is later. Let's unbox it. So, I got my paper cutter, it's really, it's taped up, let's open this quickly. Here is a coupon and they're asking me to leave a 5 star feedback, okay well we'll see about that. Okay, here is a manual, Wi-Fi repeater manual and it is in hopefully English. Yes it is. It's in English language on both sides. Perfect. So it explains the features and the setup. Okay. Okay, in this little box is a cable. Okay, I believe this is the Ethernet cable. Down like this. So this goes into the Wi Fi repeater. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, this goes into the Wi Fi repeater. Okay, and then this looks like the Wi Fi repeater. It has an air bubble cover, easily comes off, and then a little paper bag. A little plastic bag that you see at supermarkets. Okay, and then it comes. Uh, there is a thin film that's stuck to the front of it. I guess that's to protect it from scratches. So let's just take a quick look. Okay, there is a socket right over here. So here is the plug that goes into the socket. I re specifically requested. Uh, this type of plug because it's for uh, North America and Japan so perfect the European type is different before ordering they gave me an option of ordering a US plug or a European plug so let's put that there in this box okay uh, I'm gonna take off this protective film. It's pretty sticky. Perfect. Okay. This is my first time to buy a Wi-Fi repeater. I had to look it up. So it looks good. So I'm going to read to you what I have found online about Wi-Fi repeaters. A Wi-Fi repeater or extender is used to extend the coverage area of your Wi-Fi network. It works by receiving your existing Wi-Fi signal, amplifying it, and then transmitting the boosted signal. So you just plug this in and then you, you set it up on your computer. Uh, if you're on a Wi-Fi network, um, I use both. I use LAN and Wi-Fi. That's what it does. So it boosts the Wi-Fi signal. Let's look at this Wi-Fi repeater. It has no name, brand. It's just called Wi-Fi repeater. It's curved at the front like this. Okay. And uh, it has a WPS button here. And these little squares light up. So this is the power indicator. This is the wireless indicator. This is the WPS indicator and this is the LAN indicator. Okay, uh, here's a little opening. This is for the Ethernet cable. Um, there's a little reset button here. There's some, there's a label down here with some official writing. So it looks legit. 
It's pretty light. Okay, so let's assemble it. Okay, let's try to put this plug into the socket. And there's a little lever over here. I guess this, this is the release lever. This is the release lever. Um, I'm not too sure which way to turn it. I guess to, to turn it clockwise. Let's try that. Am I supposed to hear a click? Oh, did you hear that? Oh, it's pretty snug. Let's try to release it. Press down. Turn it counterclockwise. Okay, turn it counterclockwise to release it. Okay. Let's try putting it back in. Push it firmly. Oops, it's not working this time. Try it again. Oh, there. Okay, it's snug. Okay, I'll set this down, get the instructions. Uh, the next thing is to see if it works. Um, let's test it out. I'll get my laptop, set it up in the kitchen, and we'll see how good the signal is. Okay. Okay. Let's go to the kitchen. I'm in my kitchen and I have the Wi-Fi repeater. I'm going to plug it in and let's see what happens. Okay, I see the power indicator on and the wireless indicator on. Both lights are solid green. Okay, so now, oh, now they're flashing. Don't know if you can see them flashing. So now we have to set it up on the laptop. Okay, um, you're looking at my laptop. If you look at the bottom, this indicates that I have internet access. I'm going to click on that and this top, okay, you can see my router it says Buffalo G1658. This means that I'm connected to my router, the internet. Uh, and you, right below it, you can see the Wi-Fi repeater. Uh, you'll see a little shield over here. That means it's not connected. So I'll click that and, and I'll click this button. It says Setsuzoku, which is connect. Okay, and then I'll just click out. And if you notice at the bottom, notice the yellow shield on the Wi-Fi signal. That means it's not connected. So I'll just open up a browser. I'll choose Google Chrome. It looks like I'm connected, but I'm not connected. Let's just type in uh, CNN in the search box. And nothing it means I'm not connected to the internet. So I have to set this up. I'm going to go up to this web browser URL box delete everything. I'm going to type in HTTP colon forward slash forward slash 192.168.10.1. Hit enter and that, oh, perfect. Gets me to this window. Okay, so this is the IP address. 192.168.10.1 is the IP address for this device. Enter the username and password, then click OK to log in. The default username is admin and the password is admin. So this is what I'm going to do. A-D-M-I-N, go down here again. A-D-M-I-N, and luckily it's in English. What other languages does this have? French, Spanish, Portuguese, and Chinese. I want English, so just leave it on that and submit. Click submit. Okay, what's next? After logging in, you will see the page below. Okay, this is the page. Click on repeater to continue. Right here. 
this one. So I'm going to click that. Okay, and it says wireless repeater mode, SSID, channel, security, signal, and select. So it's scanning right now. Okay, now it has my router on top, Buffalo, G168, guest, and a home, whatever that is. I'll just go down until I find the repeater. Okay, which one do I select? Okay, select your wireless SSID to continue. So it's this one. I'm using this Buffalo G1658 and I want my repeater to connect to this. So click that. And it says connect to Buffalo G1658, repeater SSID, Wi Fi repeater, security key. That is um, the password that comes with your router. So, okay, I typed in typed in my security key. Apply, okay, it works. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Um, the Wi-Fi repeater is at the top and lo it looks like it's connected to the internet. Yep, it is. So let's just close this window and let's see if I can open up the browser again. Let's tech. Okay, I'm testing it out. Let's type in ABC News. Oh, that was fast. Wow, it's much faster. Okay, let's go to YouTube and test out some of the videos online. Wow, that was really fast. Okay, let's try. Um, okay. Um, uh, as you can see, this is Japan Life DIY, just doing it. I'll click on this. Uh, Ladies and gentlemen, uh, today I'll be uh, changing the back tire. It looks like it's working really fast. Video play, excellent. So, I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Thank you for watching. Have a good day.